I know. You see. <laughs> All right. Um, so vlog day two, Friday, day before meet for some of us. Just gonna work out. We're we're doing like easy today. All right. Um, All right. Oh, he's the new Lorenzo. Hello, sir. Um, how are you doing, sir? Doing pretty well. How about yourself? Um, I'm doing great. Thanks for asking. Um, am I right in that there's a meet tomorrow? Um, hopefully, our original meet was canceled, but uh, the you meet regional. Our, our original meet was canceled, okay. but luckily we found a new one. And so, yes, unless CCPS decides to cancel, we will have a meet tomorrow. And where is this meet located? Uh, this meet is located at Boo Williams Sportsplex, Hampton, Virginia, seven five seven. Seven five seven. Maybe. <laughs> and uh, what will you what will you be planning on running? Uh, I, I'm running the sixteen hundred. And person behind the camera, aren't you also running? Mile. Yes, yes I am. What are the odds that you two will be seated in the same exact heat? Very likely, considering originally we were both seated only a second apart. So I like our, there's about a 90% chance of winning. Now, we're going to pretend that the man behind the camera, Noah Hester, cannot hear you. What are your chances against him, you know, like placing wise? Um, I think if you look at this, Gonna be, <laughs> I think it's going to be a race. It's going to be an eight-lap race. It's going to be a race to the end. Where do you want to position yourself coming through that last lap? With respect to what? No. My goal is going to be on And the race. Anything else that is? No. My, my goal is to stick on Noah short as long as I can, because I think that will carry me to a good time. Or to advice to So Noah. are you saying that you're more looking towards a good time than beating Noah or placing well in the race specifically? Obviously beating Noah would be ideal, but I would much rather run a 433 and lose to Noah than run a 440 and beat Noah. Do you think that you have the self-awareness to still run a good race even if Noah runs crappy? Do you understand the question? I do, thank you. <laughs> um, I feel that I will have the self-awareness. You know, the, I'm a junior. This is my third year running indoor track. This is your third year running indoor track, but after the scene you meet, that which we watched, it looked like you were fresh out there. <laughs> While true, I think that was more a fitness problem than a self-awareness problem. I feel that my fitness has improved, and thus my self-awareness has improved. And um, talking about that race and, you know, going out a little slower, what are you looking to hit first 200, first 400? Um, Really, the goal is the PR, which would be sub 436, which is a 69 average. So I'd like to go out maybe 33, 30, really 33, 34, just keep you know honest, even splits throughout. Thank you. Um, does anybody else have any further questions? Uh, more to advice to Noah. Uh, Luke doesn't have a final 200 kick. What? Can I have the mic? Where is that coming from? Um, last year, I just remember a race in... He was acting like he was gonna beat me all up on my shoulder. And then like, with the final lap to go, I just was like, I, I'm just gonna sprint, so like, you know, shoot. And then, <laughs> and then I looked behind and I won the race and I was like, where's Luke? I would like to bring up a different race, the 500 meter race, where Aaron- Who still won that race though? Aaron did win that race, but with 200 meters into the race, Aaron had about a one and a half second lead at the finish line. He had a point one second lead. Interesting. Should we also bring up? Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, everyone. We're here with uh, Noah Hester, uh, senior at James River High School. Noah, are you running this weekend? I'm running this weekend. Yes. I'm running the 1600. Running the 1600. Are you Speak aware? Um, I don't know if you were able to uh, overhear me and Luke's interview just a second ago, but are you aware that Luke also is running that race and will most likely be in your heat? Per Luke, 90, 90%. You know what? Um, because I was the cameraman, I did in fact hear that conversation play out. And um, yes, I know we're going to be in the same heat. All right, so we're continuing our interview in the hallway, walking backwards. Um, Noah, where do you expect to be Door. in that last lap? <laughs> Oh my god. You idiot. Alright, alright, alright. We're, we're with Noah again. Now walking outside <coughs> of the track. Noah, where do you want to be come that last lap? Last lap? Um, so let's see. I'm probably going to try to hit uh, last lap. We'll see, you know, it's. First eight. question is will Luke be in your sights? 
uh, will Luke be in my sights? I mean, not if I'm turned. I mean, if I'm turned forwards, <laughs> he's not going to be in my sights. If I'm running it backwards, uh, like I'm planning to the last lap, oh. then he will be in my sights. So I don't know. Um, you just gonna have to deal with that. And are you at all like mentally, uh, like a little bit flustered that the meet is now changed venues? Honestly, yes, I am a little mentally flustered. Will that affect me in my race? Um, we'll have to see. Does the but fact I that you're driving drive. east instead of west affect your performance on the track? Absolutely. Um, also, the elevation knows, is approximately 150 feet different. Well, as, <laughs> really? so you will have How more you, oxygen. All right, hold on a minute. How do you know that off the top of your head like that? <laughs> Uh, always. <laughs> Austin Tobe, are you running this week? Oh, Austin Tobe, did you just leave I'm a running, running car on the street? Yeah. <laughs> oh shit, he's coming to me. Is that your car? Aaron. <laughs> is that, is that your car? That's Aaron. <laughs> boom, boom. I will not be running this weekend. I'm injured in my calf. All right. Which Whatever one? Whatever Noah had in any given practice is what I have. <laughs> <laughs> That's that's savage. The car's like, oh, that's a that's a there's a person in the car. <laughs> 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 I got a I literally oh turned around. And there's a there's a person. All right. Um. Hello. We're here with um. No so we're here with um. No Ridgeway and Andrew Donaldson, who are both gonna be running thousands this week. <laughs> <laughs> I hope I got that. Pesky freshman. All right, um, so I'm here with um, Norah Dwayne and Andrew Donaldson, who will both be running a thousand this weekend. Um, tell me what you're thinking. Watch out for the pole. Tell me what you're both thinking. We'll, start well I'm not Noah. sure if I can run it yet. Um, I'm trying to get word from my parents if they can take me. Uh, there, there is a bus. What he wants me to be. Oh, Do you yeah. realize there's a bus? There's a bus. Okay. Well, um, does that affect your chances of running? <laughs> You don't think you're gonna run, or you do? I, I think I'm gonna run. Okay. Um, I'm yes. gonna run the thousand. Right, I said that. I said that earlier. <laughs> okay, all right. We're gonna go to Andrew. Andrew, you're running a thousand this weekend, right? Lindsay Hester, everybody. I would assume that I'm in the same heat. So same heat as it. Are you? The goal is to beat No Ridgeway and Jaden. And yeah, Noah, go to the camera. By a significant five, amount. Okay. Five seconds. Two mile. And um, no, seconds. coming off, this is, is this two your first meet of the indoor season? Yes, it is. And um, how were you feeling after your cross country season? I was feeling like I could have done better throughout the season. Like I didn't work as far as I needed to. So coming indoor, I'm really trying to Good grind. Right. So I have no more further questions. Thank you. It was locked, and he still got it. <laughs> no. Oh, God. You recording this?